What it is guys, uh, just static here and or static if that's what you want to call me. And today we're going to check out a video that I saw on Reddit and it's a video of these two couples getting married and I guess one of their friends, family or acquaintance decided it'd be funny to, uh, I guess, crash the party and or ruin their little special moment with the cake and uh, throw it in their face. So let's check it out. And as you guys can see, that was a real short clip. Um, personally, for me, I, I never really... Well, first, I'm going to take... Eh, whatever I'm going to start with. Eh, screw it. We're just going to say this from the top of my head. I don't really got a script for this video, so screw it. But I was going to say, I never really understood the whole smashing cake into people's faces. Even like, you know, even when the bride and groom do it together. Like the whole, hey, hey, you know, the wife's trying to shove cake in the dude's face. And the dude, you know, the the husband, whatever, is trying to shove cake in her face. Husband, wife, now. I never really understood that. I find that shit weird. And most of the time, those tuxes and wedding dresses are either rental. And if they did buy them, now you got to pay whatever additional money to get them shit cleaned. Like, I, that just doesn't make sense to me. I've never really been into food fights that, you know, I, I'd rather have it in me than on me. And that sounds kind of sus. But nowadays, does that sound sus? And who knows? Not everything sounds sus nowadays, but that's just for starters. Two dudes, a dick if he, I mean, like, why would you do that? Like, I mean, personally, I'm, I don't know about you. I don't know about you, but I would be mad not as the husband or bride, but as who wanted some cake, right? Because if I go to a wedding, you know, the only thing I'm really looking forward to personally is the food, right? And if I can't even enjoy some cake. I'm already pissed at it because let's be real, I ain't getting married anytime soon. And seeing another f get married and have a happy, loving relationship, and I, I, you know, that already makes me, me feel a certain way. Now I gotta watch a nigga destroy cake. I have no idea where I was gonna go with that, but <sighs> anywho, but you can definitely tell that the wife and the husband at the end of the video were like, yo, who invited this dude? Who is this? She def, I think they knew him 100%. And like, um, like I said, there's no really context to this video, but 100% he looked like, I'm going to say he was a friend, right? It could be a family member, but I'm going to say he looked like a friend, right? He was a, you know, uh, he, he was there for the bachelor party for the dude, right? He, he seemed like a friend. Definitely at the end of it, the wife looked at him like she gave that look like, yo, he will not be, hey, this is your last day to see him because you will not be having contact with him after this, right? And I mean, again, I'm just reading off of body language because they didn't really say anything. But at the end of it, the dude's looking at his friend, the dude's open, doing that open hand at aha, uh -huh, right? Uh, no, he, he'll, uh, yeah, he's, he won't be seeing that person ever again, but. I'm kind of rambling on. There wasn't really much to dissect from this video. I just saw it and I just thought, you know, that's a big move to do. I wonder if other people feel the same way and I'll just make a video about it, give my two cents. But um, guys, let me know what you guys would have done in that situation. Personally, again, as the bride and groomsman, uh, bride and groomsman, bride, I, I don't know the wedding lingo, me, people leave me alone. But as husband and wife in this scenario, cause I don't know the wedding lingo, but um, I wouldn't be mad, but I'm just being more mad as a person who's in there, a guest or a family member who just wants some cake. But like I said, I'm rambling, leaving my two cents. What would you guys have done? Uh, leave it in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next one. Easies.